this, Crystal Castles, does not work. Nothing on the screen. And if you look, the reset line, it's stuck low. The person who owned this said that a tech zapped the board and it worked and then he zapped it and it didn't work anymore. And I believe it's because this chip right here, which controls V-Blank, which also controls, V-Blank controls the, um, uh, what does it control? It controls the reset circuit, right? Affects the reset circuit. That's not, the, the signal looks good, right? Except it's way shifted. That's, uh, it should be grounded there. That The bottom should be um, down at that yellow line. So how do we know that V-Blank is the problem? Well, we know that the reset line is stuck low. And the reset line is fed by this chip, which is a binary counter at 8M. It's a 47LS193. And you can see that the reset line is the top bit, the top of the four bits on the output. Now, there's not many inputs to this chip. We see that the top bits we have, or the top inputs, we have load, which loads a number from these A, B, C, and D. Um, and A, B, C are already are just hardwired to ground, and D is hardwired to one. So it's basically loading the number eight in binary every time you load it. And eight in binary, that D, that high, corresponds to this output. So when you load it, actually the reset pin will go high. Um, <clears throat> don't worry about this input down. This is never used. And these 13 and 12 are also not used. So then the, all that we have is this load, which when this goes low, we'll, tell it, we'll, we'll have the system load the number 8 in um, he the hex number 8, which is 1000 zero, zero, zero in binary. And that will happen, that load will happen every time the watchdog gets written to. Okay, so the board normally during operation every few loops or probably, I don't know, I didn't look at the code, but probably at the beginning of every um, every um, input loop it probably writes to the watchdog. I don't actually know that, but that's a, a, a decent uh, summary. Um, so the only thing we have here besides this watchdog, which will, will load the number 1000, zero, 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 is um, DC OK. When DC OK, this is for when the game sets, sets up, DC OK will be high until this, the board detects that it has good power. When that's high, everything will be, all the outputs will be zero, so your reset line will be low. Once that, once power is achieved, then the whole thing will start, because this will go to a low, and then it won't clear everything. So the only real thing besides the watchdog and um, firing regularly is the V-blank, which is, is basically a counter. Every time V-blank goes up, it increases the counter. And eventually, if you get enough V-blanks happening, I think if I did my math correctly, it should be eight. Without the watchdog firing, um, what happens is that number um, 1000 will become, will get to, um, <clears throat> will, will actually overload and um, this output will actually come to zero. It's called overflowing. So we know that the V blank is the issue because the V blank is not um, doing the process. Okay. So um, and we saw that the V blank was stuck low. So then we just follow that back to the V-blank. And we can see here that the V-blank is generated from this LS175 at 8J. So we test the chip, we pull it out, we see we have an error. My tester should look something like this. So now we have actually it. We now have reset. But 
we're having issues on the screen. So that actually means the game's playing, but um, the screen will go green. And then you can see some scrolling sometimes. It's not doing it now. I think the problem is we have a problem now with um, 11H, which controls CompSync and VSync. If we look at 11H pin, Uh, the comp sync in 13. We have a signal. Pin 12 should be the opposite of that signal, but we have nothing. So I think that's a problem there. Now, why is that a problem? Because 11H is a 7407 which is simply a buffer or a driver it just brings out or it puts out the same signal that comes in so pin 12 should look exactly the same as pin 13 and it clearly doesn't so I mentioned that we have no I'm powering this up we have no sync Should say we have no vsync, I believe. And that, as well as some of the other things that we already try to fix, come from this chip 11H. So we're going to go ahead and pull that. That's a 7407. You can see we get an error when we um, test it with the chip tester. So this is probably bad. So I uh, plugged it in and it uh, looks like it'll be working. You can see there we have the game working.